Angel of the Lord announced unto Mary, and she conceived by the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. And Mary said, Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, <coughs> pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. And the word was made flesh. <coughs> Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour your grace into our hearts, O Lord, that we who have known the incarnation of your Son, Jesus Christ, and as by an angel to the Virgin Mary, may by his cross and passion be brought to the glory of his resurrection, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. <coughs> Amen. O oh God, make speed to save us. <coughs> o oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now comes the day. 
a reading from the Gospel according to Matthew, chapter 19, beginning at verse 23. Jesus said to his disciples, Truly I tell you, it will be hard for a rich person to enter the kingdom of heaven. Again, I tell you, it is easier for a camel to go through the eye of a needle than for someone who is rich to enter the kingdom of God. When the disciples heard this, they were greatly astounded and said, well, then who can be saved? But Jesus looked at them and said, for mortals, it is impossible. But for God, all things are possible. Then Peter said in reply, look, we have left everything and followed you. What then will we have? Jesus said to them, truly I tell you, at the renewal of all things, when the Son of Man is seated at the throne of his glory, you who have followed me will sit on 12 thrones, judging the 12 tribes of Israel. And everyone who has left houses or brothers or sisters or father or mother or children or fields for my name's sake will receive a hundredfold and will inherit eternal life. But many who are first will be last and the last will be first. He has come 
to the help come in his servant and in his For he has remembered his promise of mercy. The promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. <clears throat> Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the
we entreat you, O Lord, that there may be peace to your church and to the whole world. We entreat you, O Lord, that we may depart this life in your faith and fear and not be condemned before the great judgment seat of Christ. We entreat you, O Lord, that we may be bound together by your Holy Spirit in the communion of the Blessed Virgin Mary, St. John the Evangelist, St. John of the Cross, and all your saints, and trusting one another and all our life through Christ. We entreat you, O Lord. O God, <coughs> by his grace, your servant, John of the Cross, kindled with the flame of your love, became a burning and a shining light in your church. Grant that we also may be aflame with the spirit of love and discipline, and walk before you as children of light. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. in all ways and at all times. Amen. Amen.